In the 85th district, incumbent Republican Patrick Snyder is facing Yi Ling Zhang. That area includes Wausau and Weston. That was again because of redistricting, creating a smaller area, and it does no longer include Ringle Hatley or Bevent. And Patrick Snyder with the lead so far in that race. And for an update on that race, we do want to check in with uh, News 9's Keegan Hewitt. He's in Wausau. He's got the very latest for us. Keegan. Yeah, Eric, Melissa, you mentioned it. The AP not yet calling the race. Roughly 72% of precincts in for the 85th District Assembly. I'm joined here by the incumbent, Pat Schneider, the Republican representative, who is looking to kind of close this race up in the next few hours. Pat, what's kind of been the emotion here for you and your campaign tonight, as well as these supporters? Slow buildup of excitement. Uh, when I realized that I got about 58.4% of the village of Weston, 70% of the town of Wausau and Weston, I thought that's a good way to go into Wausau. The entire wards, all the wards in Wausau are called or in. We're just waiting for central count. We're up, uh, I think, almost 3,000 votes. You feel confident, but with the absentees coming into central count, you got to make sure, see what happens. So optimistically confident. That's a good way to be in, Pat. What would your message be to the supporters, voters, and just the community of Wausau for their support over this last decade? I just want to thank them for those that voted for me and honored to be your representative again for another two years. And for those that maybe did not choose me, I'm still your representative and uh, my door is always open. All righty. Thank you, Pat. Thank I appreciate you. that. will do it for me here at the Jefferson City Inn. Keegan Hewitt signing off. Eric, Melissa, back to you. All right, thanks. We'll pivot now to 